I came into foster caring through a, a long route, and I'm very glad I have done now because I spent two, 27 years as a school teacher, and then by sheer chance had the opportunity to work with care leavers and their education. And that's when my education began because I started to realise, although when I was a school teacher I was a bit of a champion I suppose for kids, and my partner and I would sometimes take out the kids from the local children's home on a weekend and things, or just uh, here and there. But then I started to realise the complexity of needs that these young people had. And working with them quite closely and getting to know them for 13 years, I, I was quite troubled because it seemed as if conventional society hadn't really recognised uh, what, what was required. And not out of vanity, but having worked there for 13 years or so, I thought, if I can make a difference to an individual or a few individuals, I'd like to try that. Because of my position being a single male, I look after older teenage boys and very occasionally children with more complex needs. When I was a teacher and when I worked with young people, I had one principle in mind. If these were my own children, what would I want for them? Because as parents, we usually fight tooth and nail and really don't give up on our kids and get if, try to do the very best for them. First of all, treat them as if they're your own children. Secondly, have a lot of patience because there are going to come times, usually quite, quite soon, when some of these children will test you and they want to see, are you going to let them down like other people in the past have? And you have to just remain calm, not get phased and understand it's not about you, but it's about helping them. And again, think about if it was your own child. The third factor, which is be there as much as you can, be consistent. When a young man left me, leaving care, he said, thanks for all you've done for me. And I said, I haven't done anything for you. And he said, yeah, you had. You were there. You were always there for me. I don't expect thanks for it. I, I just, you know, just hope that I can do something to help other people because that's what it's all about, really.